Yeah, hi guys, it's your boy Prophet here, and welcome to another episode of Enshrouded. As you can see, the previous episode we uh, ended up doing the f first sort of base, sort of building in a way, sort of like a mixture of having sort of heart, which is heart sort of thing, because you got the flame cauldron. Uh, didn't have that many resources because the first time, but I say I didn't do too bad. Um, I like the way. Excuse just the random blocks everywhere. This is where I just started fiddling around with it I like the way it just curves round into sort of a nice L shape. These wood beams are quite nice um, They add a bit of texture to it. Um, I added a bit of terrain So it sort of looks like it's not floating it actually sitting on top that one I did actually okay I probably need to fiddle with that one, but this is gonna be our first. This is our first actual base so this type this Episode excuse me uh, We are going to find a sleeping survivor so possibly we'll go around here curve round there'll be a little cliff around there so this is where we're gonna go so uh i'm gonna see just like magic and everything else uh pick up mushrooms along the wee it's only about 400 meters yeah there we go we see the bridge oh hi okay that's not uh, it could be worse so we're going to take all the bones. Um, I don't mind the wand. It's probably going to be a bit OP at first. But this is what we're going to do at first. Is just go for the wand. See what happens. And to be honest, I, it's actually alright. This is the rest of Long Keep. As you can see. We're just coming around the edge of Long Keep itself going to collect all the plant fibers that we actually can do pick up some more mushrooms see what's around here it's always good i find it in these sort of games to collect resources along the way so that'd be pretty cool uh the way this game looks is absolutely stunning i just can't wait to get a bit more into it dive a bit more into the lore of how everything is come here okay that's not exactly far is it See how far it goes. Okay, it's not exact. Come here, rabbit. Come here. Okay, it's a bit weird. No, this rabbit's giving me the run around. Come here. Actually, what are you? Eh, yeah, just a rabbit. It's always good to collect resources, as I said before. I keep. Exp Keep saying the same thing over and over again. I don't know why. But yeah, this episode, we're going to find the more sleeping survivors. Hopefully delve into a bit more lore. Collect a few things. Loot some more stuff. Level up. Uh, able to... There we go. Captain Journal, day six. The raiders have besieged us these past two days. Attacking from the bridge. Their eyes, such madness. We have withheld so far, but only just. We may not survive the next assault. I've ordered to rig the pass with our last munitions. If those scavengers return, we are prepared. Captain Ark White. Yeah, might as well have more wooden arrows. So we are rested. We are on the road again. Oh. What can we kill it? Oh, yeah, look, just arrows. So we can just collect the arrows, actually. That's pretty cool. I like that. Oh, sorry, guys. Oh, that's pretty cool. I quite like that. I never would have expected that, just to collect the arrows. Uh, You can't proceed without a grappling hook. Here, seek a path through the shroud. In seek a path through the shroud instead. So... We don't have a grappling hook, so we're going to go through the... Oh, there's more stuff. What's this? Read. Captain Journal. Day 20. We are hungry. We had to destroy the bridge. And with it, our connection to supplies. But it worked. We haven't seen any more scavengers. The Cinder Vault and those within it are safe. And should remain so. If we are... Look. If we are to avoid starvation, we may have to take our chances in the horrible shroud either choice is certain death so obviously yeah it just tells us about how they had to destroy the bridge and we got no way of going around it unless we go through the shroud which 
To be honest, ain't too bad. Let's have a look. It seems like we can just jump to there, go around. We could... Actually, how much is it to do grappling hook? Magical wand, staff. That's just ice, mid-range. We got armor. Uh, which one? What's up with our backpack? So, I don't need any of that stuff. The torch and that. We've got quite a few uh, grilled meat, so that's pretty good. More arrows. Twigs, which we can craft more stuff into it. Uh, I don't know how... Stay on the path. Okay. Got four minutes. Should be able to smash it out in four minutes. Just take everything... Restore time. Ah, oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's pretty cool. That I quite like that. So we have to stay on the path. In all fairness, it could be worse. What is? I doubt it'll be very, very long. Search. What's in here? Explosive powder ball. Rough flintstone workbench. Uh, rough. Flintstone block. That's pretty cool. I quite like that. Uh, more flintstone. There we go. We have literally just this little bit. We Oh my god, we can climb. Yes. That's pretty cool. That I quite like that little design. Uh, we'll get some more flintstone. This is us. Around here, we'll stay on the path. Well, we don't need to stay on the path now anymore. This game is just beautiful. I like the aesthetics of this game and the music and just... Hi. Who are you? Are you a scavenger? Metal scraps and torn cloth. We need metal scraps. <clears throat> For more stuff. Wasn't expecting that, to be perfectly honest. Just stumbled upon him like, hey. Uh, wood logs... Grab you. Don't need wood logs. And torn cloth. Why not? Disarm. Because I know what I'm like. I will accidentally run across it and just do that. And knock myself out. Gonna eat some more. Why is there two bars? Why well, have I got two health bars? So we can swing or we can jump. Uh, there's a chest down there. So we're going to just. There we go. I'd rather see the chest than what's around here. More, more wooden arrows. Are you serious? I'm going to have to. Oh, I've made a poor choice. In life. Oh, damn it. Oh, no. Hopefully I can just run across and jump. Let's see if I can make it. Hopefully. Ah, oh, you nipple. No. And I missed. And I'm probably dead. Yep. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, don't do what I just did, kids. <laughs> well, at least we got... Oh, so we don't lose our stuff upon death. That's actually quite a good thing, you know. I quite like that. Uh, traveling through the shroud. Find a sleeping survivor. Yep, we're going that way anyway. I weren't expecting that fool to kill us, to be perfectly honest. So, just gonna rest. Oh, is that stone? What is that? Shroud liquid. Ooh. More twigs. Shroud liquid. Shroud liquid. Shroud liquid. Shroud liquid. Shroud liquid. That's actually not too bad, you know. I don't know what the shroud liquid can do. Or what it can be used as a crafting material. No idea. But that's the whole point. We're going to figure out. I swear I killed you. Uh, still got about four minutes. It's fine. No need to stay on the path. Well, this is where I died. So where is where I died? 
Okay, it's not our bit. It's over here where the break is. This is literally where I died. Is there any stuff? Any collectibles? Oh, look. I found a little safe haven spot. Can we run up here? Let me run up. Nope. Okay, we're just going to have to make it the same way we did last time. Which ain't too bad. It's, it's going to be a quick one. This game is just beautiful. I like the the actual shroud effect and the little timer above. Can we collect these little things? No, we can't. Oh, our rested increased stamina. That's that's quite a good thing. Increased stamina. So we need to find a... Should have probably rested other stuff. The stamina does drain quite quickly. Uh, when you're climbing. So that's a thing. It's going to take a bit longer. Our stamina is increased when we're actually walking on the road. So that's good. Uh, quickly head up here. I think it's either good. In my head it might be the blacksmith. Or a NPC that we can use to help craft better gear. That was the wrong thing. Uh, shall we do... Uh, let's do Rusted Sword. Let's see about... Let's see what a sneak attack does. There we go. Let's loot you. Let's loot everything. Is there hide? I'm trying to test to see... Oh, repair equipment. What's that? Oh, okay. So we... so these were... this is what we came off. So this must be another uh, flameborn uh, sort of shrine sort of thing. Another failure. The cinder vessel broke down during the... during testing. The rat I used inside was charred by the coalescent flame a bright a bright flash then nothing thankfully the side effect of the blindness was only temporary i've acquired a new subject another rat igni hopefully our path to salvation i cannot accept more setbacks i will ensure that the cinder vessel holds as if my life depended on it it may well balthazar so obviously balthazar came up to here and uh was just doing experiments to try and stop the shroud and this is probably where we're going to find uh, an NPC. Like, uh, you know, that can actually be... Ah, I'd, I'd said that right, Blacksmith. Hi. Okay, that's level 17. Okay. So that's who it is. Let's just read this first. Venture forth. It's done. The cinder vessel is a delicate contraption, still volatile, yet brimming with potential and hope. The first human to enter will be our true prototype, the kindling of a new spark. Thankfully, the blacksmith volunteered. He must enter the vessel and sleep until roused anew, lest he slips into eternity. May the ashes of one age sustain the seeds of the next. Balthazar. Okay, so obviously, you know, he's trying to Preserve life and awaken survivor. Oswald Anders the blacksmith. <gasps> Summoning staff. Awesome. Uh, nails plus 16 at blacksmith. So what can we do here now? Uh, one staff. Summoning staff. Select to survival while this item is in use. That's pretty cool actually. Uh, then backpack. Where is the summoning stuff? Sigil ring. Oh. Let's equip you. Charcoal at the charcoal. Ah, yeah. oh, that's where it is. Uh, let's move you on to you. Then. Wait, where the hell's my summoning stuff? Needs building area. Uh, when you need rest, you can fast travel back to your home. 
by opening your map to navigate, blah, 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 blah. Okay. <clears throat> I thought it was going to be, if there was going to be a fast travel point. That's our two. Oh, it's a tombstone. I wonder if it's going to fast travel to our altar or to the one in thing. No, it's going to fast travel to our altar. Ready summoning staff. Okay, let's... Wait, can we... Uh... Okay. What do I need to do? Go in there? Not enough free space. Where's... Uh, are you snapping? Ah! Talking craft. Could I have something? This reminds me a bit of World of Warcraft now. Uh, craft first gear. Took you long enough to find me. Look at you. Weak and puny. And they call you Framebone. First thing you need is equipment. Lucky you woke me at first. Crafting a scrappy sword, a spike club or some armor was serve you as well. I don't know if that was um, a <laughs> good accent. <laughs> I have no idea. So we can create forge, charcoal, tin, nails, a natural decent lock pit, weapon, spike club, or a scrappy sword. Blunt, piercing. Oh, that's pretty good. A little bit of poison as well. Full armor set. Oh, dishes. I don't want dishes. Uh, One-handed weapon, spike club. I think I'd go for both just to see about what I would like to do. So we need stone, charcoal, wooden logs, more stone for charcoal kill. What do we need for you? Nails. Metal scrap, we need nails. We need four nails for you. Wood log and nails. So that is six nails. One, two, three. I think we've got nails now. So six, four, and now we need wood logs. Oh, bit of frame rate there. That was a bit weird. Oh, what happened there? Why does it feel like it's not smoothing out? Why does it feel like a little bit of a frame rate drop? Uh, let's craft some stuff. Craft and craft. Fur armor set. We need animal fur and string. Oh, all upgraded items for your backup back back bleh, from your backpack and action bars listed here. And enchanting an item unlocks new perks. Each perk costs runes. Gather runes by salvaging weapons and other equipment. So we can do okay. Well, we need string. We need fart plant favor. Uh, I'm gonna swap you for you. Swap you for you, and then what we're gonna do for you is not. Can we dismantle stuff? I wonder if we can dismantle it. Uh, okay, just delete then, and delete you. So we got seven runes from you. Delete. Uh, let's just. Okay, so we can't. Okay, unequip. Then delete. Let's equip just wooden arrow because it just we got enough. We got metal scrap. One thing we're gonna do now is we're gonna sleep. Oi. Cheeky bastards! Like, hey, hey, me wee laddie. That was actually pretty rapid, that. Uh, just going to stand by the fire. I might create another fire near the bed. So by the time we're sleeping, it saves me just resting by the fire. That's not too bad, though. I only got up to 16, which, you know, in all fairness, can be worse. You have awakened your king. The flame is pleased. Seek out more survivors slumbering in the springlands. 
Okay, so we can upgrade uh, altar, uh, altar activation. So this is upgrades pretty much anything. Time in the shroud will upgrade to six minutes. Shroud passage level two. Oh, okay. So uh, we need animal shelter cleansing glider. Oh, the flame doesn't give you wings, kids. Craft the glider at the workbench. It'll make you getting around a little easier. Perfect for your brave ones like you. Don't forget that using a glider drains stamina. But from what I've seen, you've got it in ya. I need a proper shop to smith in. Only then can I craft the right equipment for your journey. Don't fret, it's not a hard one to build. You'll need a workbench, some building blocks and a construction hammer. Let's get to work. Don't ask me about- Okay, I'm gonna just stop the accent. Amberville can still be saved. Where there's ash, there's embers, kid. The shroud suffocates the valley, so seek the elixir well with your new gear and raise the root of, of our misery. Ignite the depths and set this evil ablaze. Go on. I'm counting on ya. Flameborn. Even with this new gear, you shouldn't feel too safe out there. Rest up, eat well before you head out. A fire, a roof over your head, and some meat in your belly will prepare you for anything. Okay then. Uh, I need full armor set. We need. So, got enough torn cloth. Want. So. One, two, three, four, five, six. They need six and probably about ten for animal fur. Enter the elixir well. So we've now got workbench, charcoal clean, and forge. Okay. Now we've got the rough flintstone and more storage. Whoa, that looks sick. Oh my god, that looks awesome. And now we got grappling hook. We need mm, shout spores, 210. Okay. Anything else? Uh, window, still window frame. What's new in our backpack? Metal sheets. We need charcoal and metal scraps. What's in here? Clear the elixir well. Blacksmiths need the shop. Glider. Okay. And that's round right about here. That's literally just here. But this is our tombstone. Can we get rid of you? What's you? What's this area? Forge weaponry or armor. And then this is the love letter to Queen Jasmine. Jasmina! So, I'm going to collect a few resources. We're going to go around, collect a few things. Uh, right, let's go and collect a few things. This is animal fur. Get rid of these. Sorry, sheepies. Thank you for your animal fur. There's one there. Where's he gone? He's... Hi! Just stay there. You're so pretty. Thank you very much. For all your animal fur. Right, let's see. Twelve. That is more than enough. And then we need plant fiber for... String. Hopefully I don't fall. Oh, yeah, didn't fall. Nice. Let's just chop this down. I like the way the chopping just goes rapid. Wee, 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 wee. That is a lot of blocks. Six wood, six wood. Oh, there's a chest top. How did I miss you on the first block? Flint arrow. Yep, fine. Just take it all. Take it all. Oh. 
Good little honey. Good wax. Harvest you. Good for wax, which we can create candles. We need fireball. And twigs and everything. So, what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to see you in a few seconds. So, we're back in the shroud. What we're going to do now is... We're going to just quickly... Well, I've crafted the two bits of armor. I've crafted a helmet and... Um, Backstab. Oh. Come on then, bring it. Ouch. Oh, I quite like that. The attack's actually pretty decent. With that, let me just turn it down on my headset because I'm not up. I know I'm turning up. No, that's, that's muted. There we go. What is this? Shroud liquid, more shroud liquid. Where the hell did you come from? That was a bit much, mate. I didn't even know where they come from. Torn cloud. Uh, torn cloud? Torn cloth. Got about three minutes left. Gonna just explore everything else we can do. More torn cloth, and then we're going to end up quickly running. This should clear up the shroud a little bit, so we've got a bit of time. Nope. Okay, it obviously hasn't. Uh, I need to find a place where... Nope, no, don't sit. I need to eat. We're going deeper in. I need to find a place where it's above the shroud. Got about two minutes left. I think we're going further in. I need to get out there. I know there's a little point on where we can avoid it. Just need to get to a place where I can avoid the actual shroud itself. Right. One minute. Four. Is anything above here? Nope. So, where are we going to go? We're going to run out. So, what are you? What the hell are you? Right, got left just above one minute left. Got a rune. Nice, more cloth. What are you? Critter parts. Ah, oh, that sort of makes sense because it was a critter. So that's what I was hearing. I like the sort of, leave now. Yeah, I'm on my way. I'm, I'm, I'm running through me life, man. I have to stay on the path, otherwise I'm, I'm not going to get the stamina up again. Uh, do, 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 do. Oh my god, we're cutting it fine. We are cutting it so fine. Oh, look at that. Pumped up. Uh, let's go have some water. Well, okay, five minutes, right, so it's just there, just over there, okay, so this is the plan, run, oh my god, hopefully not die, don't run, I'll see you guys in a second, and we're back, so what I did is I drank an elixir, I need to figure out how to, you know, Get more elixirs on or craft the more elixirs on but that will be probably off camera uh i figure that out um do 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 so we're gonna quickly just run in because we got just under five minutes 
And this will be the enter the elixir well. So I'm waiting for the other bit of the stamina. So we've got double stamina. So we've got more stamina to actually work with. Which now we have. I've gone the wrong way again. It's wasted time. Time management is key. It's literally right here. So locations below. Hopefully I won't die. Oh, that was a pretty hefty. Okay, so. What's here? Loot. Restore time. Ah, oh, beautiful. I should have uh, waited for that, actually. 19. That's not too bad, actually. Oh my god, you made me jump, you little critter. Bloody jump scare. What are you? You're like a big slug. Uh, the location is above. Hi. No. Naughty. Naughty, naughty. What's this? Return beakers replenish your maximum to... Oh, okay. Um, Time in the shroud. Down near them to fill their effect. So what we've just done is... The beacon. The elixir well. Do, 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 do. Whereabouts are we going to go now? This is all looking pretty cool. Oh, I quite like this, actually. The little flame is actually pretty cool. Ah, you. Let's go. Okay, let's quickly remove... Unequip. Delete. Get you. Oh my god. Oh, okay. That was close. No, 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 no. Up, 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 up. You are not allowed to shoot me because that is rude. Very, very, very rude. Okay. So the blunt is actually pretty cool. Um, the slash damage is better. So it is higher damage. Okay, so that was that. Give me some wood. There we go, made it. Right, so one thing we're going to do is go around here and then we're going to go further in. And oh, for God's sake, hopefully not die in the process. I wonder what these are. Oh my god. Right, you're down. Let me get my health up. Oh! Died. I completely forgot to hold LB. But at least we just spawned right here. So we know... Um, <clears throat> I can spawn right here. Retrieve everything. Which is quite nice. Come on then. I ain't got all day. Thank you. There we go. Torn cloth. Because we need actually torn cloth as well. Uh, this guy's got runes. Perfect, perfect. Wonder if there's anything else around here. I'm getting shot at. Hi. I did nothing. Resisted, resisted. Actually, what's that do? So, the blunt is very effective, actually. I was reading it wrong. Anything around here? No? The location's above. That is the location. So, the one thing we can do... Okay. 
Uh, the webs I've grown pit spitting corruption flames for the air below. Enter the elixir well to find the root of this evil and eradicate it. So we need to enter round here, maybe. Wait, where was the hole? Ow! No. I thought it would be. Ah, oh, I, I don't thought it would be there. Unless it's further in. So let's just sit here for a second. Gather everything. Right. So we've gone that way. We've gone that way. Where is the hole? It's further in. Okay, that makes more sense. So it is further in this way. So do 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 do. It's my life. Ow. Okay. That explosive. That no no. It's my life and snow never. On elixir well, the the springs of the elixir. Another elixir well is built on the backs of the workers, slaving away tirelessly to gouge a tunnel into the earth. The plans for this construction are other world are otherworldly. The chasm spits fumes with every jab. Thin veils of mist cause headaches and irritate the eyes. All for the elixir. <clears throat> I hope this foul air will not spread to Lone Thistle. Uh, well, I think it's done a bit more than spread to Lone Thistle, don't you think, mate? Restore time. Loot, 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 shroud liquid, more shroud liquid. So we are in the elixir well. We need to find the root of evil. And apparently it's above. Why does that look like I can go in? I was looking the complete and out the wrong way. So this is underneath. I was just thinking there's a chest nearby. Obviously there's nuts. Don't need to crawl down. This is actually very cool. I like this. This is awesome. <laughs> Into the depths of... Oh look, there's the root of evil. A wiggly squid thing. I found it. Mom, I found it. Don't mind me, guys. I'll lead the way. It's all good in this hood. It's very eerie and very creepy. Hi. Wow. I'm just gonna pew pew you. Yeah, no, it's fine. I'll just pew pew you. And achievement. Shroud Ah, oh, so that's a shroud core. Oh, for a head. Tainted axe. Uh, yes. Oh, for God's sake. Can't take any of it. Uh, what can we get rid of? What can we get rid of? Actions. Delete. Actions. Delete. Uh, need resident. Need, uh, don't need you. Delete. Delete. Critter parts. Uh, probably don't need you. Wooden logs, definitely don't need you. 
Uh, those old magical properties of shroud could just be used for alchemy purposes. Okay. Search. Take all. Destroy the root. Wait, how do you destroy the root? Do I use this guy? Okay, uh, the shroud root is the source of us would destroy it with the felling with a felling axe and prosper. There we go. I was about to say, where's the health bar? Yeah, you skill point, skill point. I am the king, don't mess with me. So, this is all done now. Use construction hammer. Uh, the blacksmith does need a shop. Um, so that was it. Let's have a little nosy. Uh, I need food and uh, food poisoning. Uh, we need to gain a bit more health. Uh, let's use you. What's in here? Nothing. I knew there would be a chest in there. Oh, <gasps> fireball. Ooh. Okay. I think that is actually it. So that was uh, the elixir well, which obviously cannot, is basically, I see that as more of a dungeon. So we head into the dungeon. Uh, we can just travel fast, fast travel back. Actually, that's a good point. Let's fast travel back to our home. Let's just rest for a second. Uh, okay, so let's do a skill point. Um, minor out of reach. Mercer's tap. Perform Mercer's tap by uh, deal massive damage to an enemy. You've overpowered. Feel the stun ball while blocking or parrying their attacks. Sneak. Oh, okay. I was wondering where, where the hell sneak attack. Uh, the base duration for the rest of buff is increased by five minutes. Increase the comfort in your home to further increase duration. Save up. You only need three instead of six seconds to revive an ally. Okay. The uh, pickaxe, blah, blah. Quality gill. Gill? Quality gear. All tools lose durability 50% slower. Minor. I quite like that one. That's three out of four. Three out of two. Could do that one. Increase your endurance attribute by one. Or we could do that one. Endurance, which is still more endurance. Dexterity. Dexterity. Spirit. Constitution. More health point. Uh, we're going to do you. We still can increase our endurance. Beast Ranger. Assassin. Trickstar. Wizard. Tank. Nemesis. Damn. Uh, I'm not too sure on what to do. We could do Battle Mage. That's pretty cool. Or Healer or Wizard. Uh, I'm not too sure on which way to go, to be perfectly honest. Intelligence Creature increases magic damage by 5% per attribute point. Oh, I'm, I'm actually not too sure. That's a level three. Uh, let's equip you. Nothing. No glide art. No grappling hook. No ring. No shoes. Uh, okay. 
So, one thing is I need to build him a thingy. Ember Veil can be reclaimed. Collect sparks and offer them to at, at the flame altar to strengthen the flame. Sparks lie scattered around the world in flame sanctums and flame shrines. Yes, why not? So now we got a bigger building area. So if I go up to build, look at the size of our building area now. It's massive. Wait, where? Could... It reaches out all the way over here now. Instead, it used to reach out round about where that block is. That's crazy. That is absolutely mental. Uh, I'm gonna sleep, mate. So, night night. Uh, actually, I need to build. I need to build. I need to build. I need to build fireplace. Perfectly honest. Uh, no, let's not pick up. Let's sleep. Hopefully, we gain more. I it's a bit annoying. So this is our. Uh, what do we need from here? Flame art and base improvement. Uh, we're gonna find another base soon. So he needs a shop. We need to build a glider. Yep, 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 yep. So claim spot for your base. We need to build another base. I'm perfectly honest. Slept. Yes, 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 yes. Come on, just slowly rest up. What can I cook? Whoa, cook nothing at the moment. Uh, actually, I can cook you. Let's just put you there. Anything else I can cook? So, let's just cook some of this. That's done. That's done. Right, we've done you and you. Let's have some wood here. I need to craft something. So... Uh, I tried to turn over there was Sunder now that you brought me back to life. I don't even recognize the place. Try and get a better view at the top of that ancient spire over yonder. Well, yeah, over there. He's looking about over there, actually. So that's what he means by ancient spire. And that will be next episode. So thank you very guys. Thank you. Ugh, thank you. Ugh, thank you very guys. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you give a like, give a subscribe. Any support is good support. It will help out the channel very, very much. We're meaning that I can post out more things to do. So I hope to see you guys on the next one. Are you going to say goodbye? Are you going to say goodbye? No, you're just going to keep screaming. Oi. So going to go around here. Going to go over here. Uh, we need to find a new place to build, a new base, need to head up there. Yes, 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 I know. I need to build you something, don't I? So, see ya.